2021 Academic Scholarship and Awards Virtual Ceremony. Hello, I am Dr. Claudia Habib, President of Portable College. On behalf of the members of my administration and the Portable College Foundation, I am grateful for the opportunity to welcome you to this Virtual Scholarship Award Ceremony. At PC, we strongly believe in our core values of equity, collaboration, innovation, and accountability, which are the foundation of our commitment to help students grow intellectually, personally, and professionally. Our mission is to provide each student with an outstanding education that is affordable and accessible. Accomplishing our goal is possible because of the great work and support of the Porterville College Foundation. The Foundation Board works all year round to find ways to support students and programs. They are passionate and focused in their devotion to student success. In this virtual ceremony, we celebrate our scholarship recipients. These are amazing students who often had to overcome great odds to pursue their college degrees. We also honor the donors who made it all possible. I want to express my deep gratitude to the foundation and to those whose generosity opened doors for students to realize their dreams. Your contributions do make a huge difference. I hope you enjoyed this program. Let us congratulate the scholarship recipients and let us give thanks to all who made this occasion possible. Thank you. On behalf of the Portingo College Foundation, I'd like to congratulate all of our scholarship recipients. The theme of this year's scholarship ceremony is perseverance. The last year has certainly been a struggle for each of us, for faculty, for staff, and for our students. But the persistence of all of our staff, students, and the organization has really brought us through to show that student success is at the forefront of all that we do to help students achieve their goals. My name is Hannah Haberkorn. I am currently getting my associates in biological and physical science, which I will use to transfer, fingers crossed, to Santa Barbara to pursue a bachelor's in physiology where I can then apply to medical school because my dream is to be an emergency physician. The scholarship money I receive goes directly to my tuition and books and other supplies I need to fulfill my educational needs. It helps take some of the burden off of myself and my family knowing that I can pay for that without having to ask my parents. It means the world to me. I just really want to say thank you. It means a lot that not only are you helping support my educational dreams, but you're showing me that you not only believe in them, but my ability to achieve them, and that's very motivational for me. Walker. My educational goals is right now I'm at PC studying uh, education, elementary education. I'm graduating this spring. Um, I should be transferring to Fullerton or Monterey. I haven't made my decision yet. Um, I'm studying to be a teacher, so I hope to get my bachelor's degree at whatever college I end up at, join a credential program, and then start teaching after that, and then hopefully go back to school for my master's degree. My family does struggle financially, and um, I've never applied for scholarships before and I'm really excited to have been able to be awarded. It's going to help me a lot in my career path since paying for college is kind of an issue coming from my own pocket and my parents' pocket and uh, having scholarships come from PC will help me a lot in continuing my educational career. I want to say thank you so much for your kind and generous support through these scholarships that I'm going to be awarded. Uh, it means a lot to me and my family and I'm really thankful. My name is Eliza Lopez. I am a first year student here at PC. Um, 
I am currently working on my business and administration degree. I am the first in my family to go to college. It's very important because I am also the oldest of four siblings. So I basically have to go through everything, go through college, go through all the steps to put them in a better path. So here I am, I am a 4.0 student. I already have 62 credits and I just want to be the best role model for my siblings. Whenever I hear the word scholarship, I really take advantage of it because my parents aren't, they can't, they're, they're not financially stable enough to pay for my classes. So when every scholarship opportunity, FAFSA, EOPS, anything that I can, um, that can help me financially, I, that's how I help them. They haven't paid one dollar out of their pocket for any of my classes, any of my books, anything. It's always EOPS, it's always FAFSA, it's always, um, I just want to make life easier for them so they can deal about my younger siblings. They could deal with my younger siblings and not have to deal with being in debt. Or I don't have to ask for student loans. I don't have to be in debt. I don't have to worry about paying anything. It's all, I'm just taking the opportunities that are given to me. I would really like to say thank you because you are changing a lot of people's lives. There's a lot of students that that don't want to go to college because they don't have the money, but thanks to people like you, you can allow them to have the basically what their parents didn't have. I am Hispanic. Most of our parents did not go to school, did not go to college, did not go to high school. And the fact that we have people helping us financially really, really helps us like bring our family forward, bring our, like you make us want to step up and be something better. My name is Michelle Toner. My educational goals is to graduate PC with my AA in social science. After graduation, I plan to go to Fresno Pacific University, the Visalia campus, and there I will be getting my BASW, my bachelor's in social work. I want to be a social worker, but I want to be the social worker that brings the families back together. I want to help reunite the kids with their families and make sure they're in a safe, loving, and comfortable environment. For me to get a scholarship, I feel very blessed. Um, even through the pandemic, financially is kind of hard for us right now, but we're making it. So to receive a scholarship will allow me to get my books early and have a chance to look through them and be ready for school and also get my supplies and make sure all my bills are paid. I just want to say thank you for your support with the scholarships and being able to help me and my family. My name is Saul Navarrete and my educational goals are to receive my bachelor's from a four-year university, take the LSAT, go to graduate school, and uh, just become a lawyer. Receiving a scholarship to me means that my efforts have been worth it, that my time, and just my time, my effort, my studies, that everything that I've been working towards has been, um, that it is valid and I am on my way to make a career for myself. I would like to pay a huge thank you to the people who are granting me a scholarship. It shows that you, you believe in me and it helps me believe in myself as well. So thank you very much. My name is Sofia Celeste Jimenez and I am 30 years old and I'm attending PC. Right now I'm ending my second semester of the registered nursing program. I also have accumulated my um, associate degree of communication as well as biological and physical science here in PC. I am also working um, on my bachelor's through University of Phoenix. 
once I graduate, hopefully I will pass NCLEX on the first try. Mm -hmm. um, and I will be wanting to either work at the Veterans Hospital or in the NICU. First of all, it's such an honor to be one of the recipients of the scholarship, so thank you to the donor or donors. Um, it's going to help me in the sense that I won't have to work as much outside of the registered nursing program, so that way I can focus on getting good grades and becoming the best nurse that I can. My name is Luz Garcia. My educational goal is to someday to become a Spanish teacher. Right now I'm not working and the only money in my house is my husband's and that is only for the basic things so without this help I couldn't continue studying. Well, I'm very thankful to, to the donor because without um, their help uh, I couldn't be here studying. You're not, never going to regret doing that because we as students feel the, the responsibility to, to contribute to the, community, to the community someday. My name is David Rivera and I'm majoring in history. I want to become a history teacher, uh, not just a good teacher, but to be a mentor for students that don't have a mentor. It's going to help me out financially and with my tuition, as well as my books. Um, it's going to be a great help. If COVID wasn't around, I would shake his hand for her and thank you and appreciate him for all the help that I'm receiving because of it. My name is Olivia De La Cruz and I will be transferring to Fresno State this upcoming fall semester. I will be getting my degree, my bachelor's degree in communicative disorders, speech language pathology. I currently work in the special education field already as a paraprofessional, so I hope to continue to work with children with special needs. I just want to say thank you to the donor. I greatly appreciate it. It's going to be a great blessing to me and it's going to help me. It's going to make schooling a lot easier for me probably won't be as stressed out and the the end goal is to help children through speech language pathology so um, it's going to be a great blessing to me. My name is Guadalupe Hernandez and my educational goal is to attain a bachelor's degree in biological sciences at Sacramento State. Receiving a scholarship means that I won't have to worry about the financial aspects of getting a higher education. I can just focus on my um, classes and schoolwork and maybe even um, internships. I would like to thank the donors for giving me um, this scholarship as it will help me um, pay for the costs of textbooks, tuition, housing. It just relieves stress. Maria Tobias and I am currently completing my general education here in PC and I am planning to transfer to a four-year university after that to complete my bachelor's degree in business administration focused in accounting and after I graduated hopefully I'll be able to complete the requirements and pursue on becoming a CPA. Getting this scholarship means a lot to me especially in this situation that I am currently supporting myself especially with my education, with a little bit of help of my aunt. And I am planning to use this scholarship to help, my, uh, to help with my financial, um, to help to pay for my education. 
I want to say thank you very much for this opportunity and it really means a lot to me. My name is Frances Sanchez and I plan to finish my last year of the nursing program, then work as a labor and delivery nurse and possibly down the line go back to school for my bachelor's and my master's for a nurse practitioner. For me, this year is my final stretch from a long time of being in school, so to have the help in this last year, so that's going to lead me to being able to have my dream career, it means a lot. I really appreciate um, you thinking about Portable as a community, thinking about um, this college, supporting students and education in general, and I really appreciate the help. My name is Paul Vera and my educational goal is to obtain a bachelor's degree in agriculture studies um, from Fresno State and possibly a master's degree. I would like to become uh, an agriculture teacher either for the high school or college level. Getting a scholarship means that all those long nights you know spent studying um, and all the extra activities that I missed out on, you know, the parties and stuff that I had to stay home for studying for a test, um, it means it paid off. I'd like to thank the donors for helping me um, or for investing in my educational journey and um, helping me continue on uh, to Fresno State. Um, it really helps a lot and helps ease that financial stress that us as students uh, see, you know, paying fees and um, buying books and stuff like that. So thank you so much. My name is Suzanne Grove, and my career goals started out as a um, ag business major, which I will graduate with in a couple weeks. Um, I've decided to continue pursuit of a liberal arts degree, and I'm hoping to perhaps um, go into teaching. A scholarship means to me at this point encouragement. Um, there have been enough discouraging things going back to the classroom after 30 years. And instinct COVID. Um, so the encouragement of a scholarship just helps me finish up what I need to finish up here and, and keep going. I wish they could be here in person right now. I would say um, thank you and that I'm really grateful for the support. I'd also tell them that my experience with the professors and the students in the classrooms is very much worthy of the investment that they're making. Um, I've had a stellar experience here. So I'm grateful for that as well. My name is Santa Juanita Baldwin, and my educational goal first primarily is to be able to get a uh, to graduate because I'll be the first in my family. I'm studying business and Spanish. Y ahora puedo hablar mucho más mejor el español que antes. And uh, I would like to combine the two together. And I want to thank uh, the donors for just their generosity and for. Uh, accepting me. My name is Esperanza Sanchez and my career goals is to stay here for a while until I finish my associate's degree and then so I could go and transfer to either Fresno State or Bakersfield. It's an honor for me to receive this scholarship because in these rough times I will be paying for my books or utilities that I need. I thank them for this opportunity that they gave me the scholarship. My name is 
Serena Hernandez and my education is for social science and my career goals is to work with youth that are um, troubled youth um, to let them know that um, they're not alone in this and at times um, teenagers don't want to listen to their parents and at times they will, um, they will help to listen to another adult and give them advice and that's what I want to be there for. The scholarship means a lot to me. This is my first time um, coming back to college so um, getting this scholarship just made me realize that I can do this and um, to move forward with my career I know I can do it and um, push forward. I would like to thank you guys um, tremendously. Tremendously, This um, means a lot to me and um, like I said before um, this is my first time back, so getting this scholarship means a lot to me, and it means, to me it means that um, I'm doing great, and I know I can do this. My name is Winnie Carranza and my educational goals is to get an associate's degree in science and then transfer to Fresno State and continue in nursing to become a registered nurse and specialize in pediatrics. Getting a scholarship would help me so much because the classes I'm taking to become a nurse are very time consuming and this money can like help me pay for my classes because I hate asking my parents for help. And I also have an older brother who's currently at Fresno State. Thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to like improve my education. My name is Maria Milan. Um, my major is in elementary teacher education and I will be continuing for PC this fall but then transfer next year um, to Fresno State. Scholarship means to me that I'll be able to focus on my studies and continue to pursue um, my goals and allowing me to have a financial peace of mind. I would like to say a thank you. I really appreciate um, you helped me up a lot. My name is Jessica Perez. Um, I attended Martinsburg College last year and I received my associate's degree in um, health administration and I decided I wanted to be more hands-on. So I'm going to PC now to do my prerequisites for the nursing program. I want to be working on the, um, in like the hospital on the floor. I do want to be like a flow nurse and then decide where I want to specialize. I do want to go um, continue for my bachelor's and maybe my master's to become a nurse practitioner. Personally, a scholarship is like a huge accomplishment for me. It's something I never thought I would even qualify for. Um, I had a teacher push me to apply for it and it's, I'm very proud of myself for being able to receive it. I do have three children and a husband, so that also helps with that, so I don't really have to worry about so much financially at home. I can focus more on school. Oh, I wanna say thank you, I really appreciate it. Like I said, this will help me achieve, uh, lean towards achieving my goal to provide for my family and offer my children a better future. My name is Nayeli Samaripa Contreras and I'm currently majoring in elementary teacher education to become an elementary, an elementary school teacher. Um, after graduating from Portable College, I want to transfer to Fresno State Visalia campus to join their ITEP program where I can get my bachelor's degree and teaching credential within two years. And I hope to come back to my community in Tarabella, California to become an elementary teacher there. Receiving a scholarship to me means that somebody's seen potential in my educational career and that they want to financially support me. 
and it means a lot to me because it reduces the cost for books, school supplies, and any other resources I may need to be successful in my education. I want to say thank you because I wasn't really expecting to receive one. It's actually the first one I'm probably receiving this year after I applied to several, and I'm very grateful for it, so thank you. My name is Giovanna Jacinto and I'm currently pursuing my associate's degree in social sciences and I will be continuing at Portoville College for the continuing fall semester and I am pursuing a major in so, um, psychology. I want to be a school psychologist. Okay. I feel like it's a once in like a lifetime opportunity and once you're like notice it just means that like you're headed in the right direction it means that like I'm on the right path and I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. I just want to say thank you to all of the donors because it's a lot of work to put into it to provide for the students and it helps out the community a lot. So thank you so much for everything you've done. My name is Brianna Gonzalez and my educational goals are to become an elementary teacher. How it'll help me is by first not having to worry by looking into a job. That's really time consuming in my, per like, in my personal experience because I have to babysit my siblings. So I can really depend on that scholarship to like not, not like get like distracted with that. And also like student debt, I don't have to worry about that and having to like worry about paying it off later on. I wanted to say thank you, it means a lot because I really like need it. <laughs> My name is Oscar Garcia and I'm majoring in biology and my career goal is to be PA a physician assistant. Right now my family and I are financially stable and it would help a lot since PA school is pretty expensive and I want to complete my dream of becoming PA. From my bottom of my heart, thank you because this means a lot to me and to my parents since they can't afford to take me to PA. My name is Erica Kuhn. I'm a nursing and commercial arts major here at Portoville College. Uh, my goal right now is to uh, finish next spring um, with my commercial arts degree as well as my nursing degree and then uh, get into the RN program. Uh, I'm currently in LVN so I'll be bridging. And uh, nursing is kind of my practical job. Uh, art is my passion that I would one day like to make a career out of. Well, initially, the scholarship just means that I'm um, doing what I was supposed to be doing. I'm working hard, and it's kind of a reflection on that, that I'm um, getting where I need to go. And it means that I can work a little less and focus more attention on school, because uh, it is kind of hard to balance the two things. And um, it's going to help me finish up and pursue, continue my goals as a nurse. Thank you so much for uh, considering me and choosing me. Um, it's just, it's really, it means a lot to me and it shows that all my hard work is paying off. So thank you so much. My name is Trenton Hunter and my goal is to be a history teacher and eventually a historian and history professor. So a scholarship is just going to allow me to continue my educational goals because I'm going to need, need it for all the degrees that I'm trying to get and also just 
to try and survive by myself. I just like to tell them thank you and that they're making a big difference in my life. Uh, my name is Celeste Giona. I started Portable College in 2019. I've been at Portable College for about two years now. My major is biology and physical science. I plan to transfer to continue in a biology or nursing program, and I plan to work to put myself through medical school later in my life. Having a scholarship is important to me because it makes me feel like, like all the hard work that I put in, like having to stay up late, doing work, studying, getting things done for my education actually means something. And it makes me feel recognized like as a student. Um, and yeah, it makes me feel pretty important about my education. Thank you so much. Uh, this makes me feel really, really proud and happy and thank you again. Emily Soto, my educational goals are well, ultimately to become a therapist for, or a trauma therapist for first responders. I used to work at the police department and my heart is deeply rooted in helping the, our first responders, so I think this is the perfect career path for me. Um, it means a lot to me. It is going to reduce the financial burden that I have, especially during COVID, and it encourages me to push even harder to complete my educational goals. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. I don't think I have the words to express how grateful I am for this opportunity. Uh, my name is Perla Mascoro and my goal, my career goal is criminal justice, administrative um, justice, public safety. I would like to be a correctional counselor uh, in the prisons and I want to move up the ranks as fast as possible. Being that I didn't have any financial aid help, um, I've had to do this all by myself. I am recently divorced, uh, trying to find my way and path in life even though it's late in life for me. Um, so it means a lot to me to help pay for books and and the websites and any of this, the fees or expenses that come up with going to school. So every little bit helps. I would like to say thank you for considering and I was really surprised that I was um, chosen for a scholarship. I've never gotten a scholarship in my life so um, it's a blessing to know that I met that criteria and it makes, it makes me feel good that um, at least I was noticed in that academic part. My name is Delicia Soleil and I am planning to teach a special day class at an elementary school and then I'm planning to major in communication so when I retire I can be a professor. Right now it's difficult, especially with COVID, um, working and trying to provide all the books and everything else that we need to survive. So a scholarship would help with that. Thank you and I appreciate everything. My name is Ryan Fisher and I am going to be pursuing my bachelor's at CSUB and uh, after that the goal is to be a news journalist or a sports journalist or work in the radio, just anything to do with uh, communication. You know, I'm 35 years old, I have five kids, I'm married, I have a house, I work, so taking the gap of 17 years between high school and college and receiving a scholarship uh, just lets you know that if you want to do something, all you got to do is put your mind to it and get to the grind. If, if I can do it with five kids working, a wife, and a house, there should be no excuse for anybody else.
thank you for this opportunity. It won't uh, be misused. It will be used in the most respectful way that I've been approaching my college career already. Uh, and I really appreciate the opportunity to continue my education. Thank you. My name is Natayana. Um, my major is uh, Biological and Physical Science. After my general education, I plan to apply to PCs, um, a nursing program in order to become a nurse. It will give me an opportunity to give back to my community. It means a lot for me and my family. I have a son attending university and my data is going to PC soon. So this scholarship will be a great financial relief for us. I want to thank my donor. And honestly, I don't have enough words to show my gratitude. Um, I just hope um, all the help that went to them and all. Thank you so much. My name is Edith Campos. I am majoring in nursing. I want to become a registered nurse. That's my ultimate goal. And I plan to transfer to a university, but so far I will be continuing Portable College. Receiving a scholarship means a lot to me. It shows that my work is paying off. It also shows that my parents' work is also paying off because without them, I wouldn't be here. I have the opportunity that they didn't have and I am here in college and I want to have a great future and one day repay my parents and everything they did for me. I want to thank you and I am very grateful that I have this opportunity to have a scholarship. I would love to continue my, my education, it's very important to me and I am grateful that you selected me and gave me this opportunity. So I am very grateful, thank you. So my name is Carlos Garcia. Right now I'm in the registered nursing program here at Porterville College. Um, I'm graduating in May and my plans are to transfer to Fresno State to pursue my RN to BSN. So my ultimate goal is just to uh, give back to my community. So basically work here in the area and help everyone out. It actually means a lot. It means that um, I guess doing the work paid off and uh, I'm really grateful to receive the scholarships or scholarship. So I want to thank all the donors um, for everyone making it possible for people to receive these scholarships as well as me. Um, I really appreciate it and it will help out to reach my overall educational goal. Um, hi, my name is Clarissa Reyes Galindo, and my educational goal is to become a forensic psychology, forensic psychologist, and to ultimately work with the FBI. Getting a scholarship is going to be a great help. I come from two immigrant field working parents who have to raise me and five other kids, so college isn't our priority. So getting a scholarship is probably one of the greatest blessings I could get, especially when it comes to continuing my education and furthering it. So I'm really grateful and thankful to even get a scholarship. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. You are making such a great difference in my life and you are allowing for me to continue my dream and continue working toward my goal. So thank you and sending you lots of blessings and hope you continue to do this with so many other students. is elementary education. I plan to return to PC in the fall next year and then go on to a university for a um, 
bachelor's degree in liberal arts. And then I plan on getting a master's degree in psychology. My career goal is to work in a school setting and become a school psychologist. Getting a scholarship means so much. I'm a first generation college student. And um, financially, this will help me with books, um, household bills, any any kind of financial means to help support any of that is is wonderful. Thank you for considering me for this opportunity. It's greatly appreciated. My name is Ruben Romero and some of my educational goals is I'm going to be transferring to Fresno Pacific University to obtain my bachelor's degree and pursue my career either in teaching or maybe become a professor one day here at Portville College. What it means to me to receive a scholarship is actually um, a lot and the reason is because growing up you know my parents have shown me that coming to school every day, turning in your assignments, all the hard work will pay off one day. And these scholarships have showed that to me. Thank you for um, taking your time to review my application, for choosing me, and also just for um, supplying these scholarships for students that are in need. So my name is Celita Chavez and I'm a first year student here at Portable College and I'm currently trying to major in Advanced Information Systems and Business Information Systems and for that it's been a really fun time here at Portable College because the professors have made it really easy especially you know in the current situation we are in so it's been great. Receiving a scholarship is uh, very meaningful to me because it not only helps me in my future goals, but it also helps me stay motivated and continue in school. You know, having to worry a lot less about the financial need that, you know, I may have, I can st stay motivated and focus on my studies. This donation, like, you don't know how much it means and how much not only it will help me, but my future goals and my future, and like, regarding my path. Hi, my name is Marisa Lopez, and my educational goal is to hopefully uh, graduate and get a bachelor's degree. As I'm going to transfer to a four-year institution, and I will be re hopefully receiving a bachelor's degree in biology. My career goal is to become a conservation scientist. My plan is to help uh, protect the environment in any way I can, along with the people and the animals that live in it. And I hope to make a difference in the future for the better of humanity. To me, a scholarship means hope and new possibilities. Um, with the scholarship, I hope to be able to purchase things like school supplies or use it for transportation or housing. And it'll help me throughout my educational journey as I continue on to a four-year institution. Um, it definitely means that I will be able to have access to more things that can help me with my career goals as well. I would like to say thank you so much to all the donors that helped make this possible. Um, I will definitely make it count. I will work hard and my best and I will use the money that is given to me to the best of my ability for my education. And I really appreciate it and I thank you so much for making a difference in my life that will help me in the future and in return hopefully in the future I will be able to help everyone back. My name is David and my career goals is to, um, I'm 
my degree is for information systems. I want to be sort of like a secretary. I'm, I'm already getting offered jobs on LinkedIn for typing 40 words a minute and I would like to follow with that and get a job that types 40 words a minute. It's really an accomplishment for me because I'm a DRC student and it's a big accomplishment for me. And with that, I can probably help out with DRC and um, probably apply to be a secretary for DRC or try to help out with however I can with DRC. I'd like to say thank you for uh, picking me. Um, I worked hard and now I'm gonna work even harder. And thank you for from DRC. My name is Mauricio Mendoza, um, and as of recently, um, I've decided to pursue a bachelor's degree in civil engineering. Um, however, the only problem is that I'm interested in a lot of applied sciences, so um, I might decide to pursue another more advanced degree in a similar field. All, all the support I've received throughout my educational career um, uh, definitely helped me um, regarding the financial burdens that have been presented to me. Um, but besides the emotional clarity uh, that a scholarship might provide, um, I, I believe it's a huge motivational tool. Um, I, I feel like it would compel me to continue improving. Um, and of course, um, it would of course help me uh, reach my educational goals. I would just like, I, I hope I could express all my thanks to you um, for even considering um, my circumstances and of course, uh, um, I'd like to say thank you again for um, also lending your support towards me. My name is Oriandi. My educational goals are to finish my associate's degree here in Portville College and then transfer to a four-year university to get a bachelor's degree so I could become a financial examiner and someday run my own business. Well, it's really motivational for me. Like, it really helps me push myself and then also knowing that I have the support from my community from the Portable Scholarship. So it's just really helpful to know that I'm not alone in this educational journey. So I really greatly appreciate this opportunity and this scholarship that you guys have been giving me. And it's just a great help and just appreciate it overall. Sandra Berber and I'm currently an RN student at PC. I graduate May 2022. Um, I plan to do my bachelor's at University of Phoenix soon after. I currently work at Portoville Developmental Center and I plan to stay there and get some experience at Sierra View uh, part-time. It means a lot to me especially during COVID where the um, our, our um, resources are limited and then the nursing supplies are very expensive. I currently have like nursing shoes that cost a lot but are very uncomfortable and that will help me get better shoes for my 12 hour clinical shifts. I want to thank you for considering me and uh, thank you for the opportunity and for being so generous. Irma Magallon, and I, uh, my um, major is uh, child development, and my goals are to be able to get a, a certificate or uh, AA in, in uh, child development so that I can uh, work at a school environment and help kids, uh, and um, my career goals are just to keep going to school as long as it takes to be able to, to fulfill that. I was super excited when I heard I didn't even think I would be able to get something like that because of just my education, you know, getting here at my age and stuff. But uh, it just, to me, it means just more, uh, more opportunities 
and more of a flexibility to be able to accomplish them, an incentive to be able to accomplish them and give it my all, especially since, you know, there's uh, people willing to help out, you know, I just say give it, give it my all, that's just so encouraging. Oh, I'm getting this, I would just thank them and bless them and, and give them a big tight hug because they're, um, they're helping me out so much when, you know, the struggle out here is real and, you know, having someone do that is just an amazing thing. My name is Robert Rose and my educational goal is to eventually get my master's in nursing. Um, here at Portville College I want to apply to the nursing program in the fall and hopefully get accepted into the 2022 um, nursing program where I can complete that so I can take my test to receive my nursing license. For me it's, it's a huge thing because I mean everybody has priorities and everybody has responsibilities. I have to work a lot. Um, to pay for school, which means I'm away from my family a lot. Um, receiving a scholarship for me would mean that I could work a little bit less, which would allow me to focus more on my studying, and it would also allow me to spend more time with my family. You know what, I would like to just thank everybody for the opportunity because even, even taking small classes, everything adds up and having a little bit of assistance, any chance you can get it goes a long way in, in helping people further their education. And education is something that I've learned you have to continue throughout your lifetime and in any kind of assistance you can get in that is, is awesome and I'm thankful for, for the opportunity. Hi everyone, my name is Brianna. This is my final semester here at Portoville College. I'll be graduating soon and transferring to CSUV where I'll be majoring in criminal justice. I plan to receive my bachelor's and pursue a, a career in paralegal work. This scholarship means a lot to me, especially as a first generation college student. It not only motivates me to continue my education, but it also helps relieve some financial stress, especially with tuition, supplies and books and it just helps me want to continue my education. I'm so grateful to be a part of Portable College and I'm so grateful for the donors and staff who made receiving this scholarship possible. Thank you for investing in my education. My name is Madison Cover, and my educational goals is to eventually receive my master's in nursing education and become a nurse educator. And so getting a scholarship means that all my hard work for the past couple years is paying off and it's going to help me pay for my bachelor's, tuition books, um, cost of boards to get my license, intern permits and all that stuff. Um, I just want to say thank you to the donors and to everyone else who has supported me, my parents and everyone. and I'm majoring in social science to get my AA. I'm hopefully use it to better myself and continue my education. That way I'll already have one degree out of the way. I would like to be a vet tech. That's why I wanted to get my AA first and then go on to be a vet tech so I'll have two degrees. It kind of means a lot because it proves that I had like a lot of hard work put into my schooling and all my professors and uh, family and stuff were supportive and I could, I could use it financially to put towards my other school I want to go to. Thank you like a thousand times because it means a lot because I've worked so hard on my GPA and all my schooling.
My name is Fernando Palacios and for the fall 2021, I plan on continuing at PC. With my kinesiology major, I plan on becoming an occupational therapist and I plan to help those who need help getting back to doing everyday things. The scholarship means to me is another reminder that hard work pays off. And so it's more motivation to keep pursuing my dream and keep pursuing my educational goals. And it reminds me to not give up. Even though it may seem hard in the moment, it'll be all worth it in the end. Well, I just want to say thank you for this scholarship because uh, especially in these COVID times, it's kind of hard uh, balancing job and school because uh, with money, financial situations right now, so this scholarship means the world to me because it doesn't, uh, financial situation doesn't leave me stressed. Santiago Sanchez is the second and my educational goal is to eventually become a history teacher. Uh, my major of choice is history. Uh, I want to work for you, I want to teach US and world history and eventually work my way up to an athletic director after over time of teaching so eventually be in charge of all sports because I love sports and my end goal is to be an AD because I, I want to be in charge of sports. I, I think that's a pretty cool end goal. What it means to me having a scholarship means a lot. It means that it shows, I'm proud of it because it shows my success, it shows how hard I've worked and it also shows the part I've put into with my parents and you know uh, just being able to support them because I know I won't be paying for my tuition fully and just to have the scholarship even just to pay for books, to pay for how, to pay for something is better than nothing and that just shows like I said just shows I'm proud of it. I'm proud to show that I got scholarships because it's not easy getting a scholarship. And despite whatever, if it's a little bit or nothing, it's still something and I'm very proud of it. It means a lot to me and it shows how hard I've worked put in the classroom. I would like to say thank you so much for choosing me as a scholarship recipient. I really appreciate it and I promise you I will make PC proud and I will make, I will do what I can to go far as, as far as I can in my education goals. Seema Bukhari Dash Kwaja Richardson. Both the middle names are tongue twisters, so I generally go by Seema Richardson. My major is communication. My goal is to have a PhD in communication and travel the world as a public speaker, something that I love doing, and tax free travel is always an incentive. So I'm one of those people who truly believe and live by the motto that I am forever 35 and pretty soon my kids will be older than me. And I say that seriously without joking. I truly believe that the scholarship allows me to get wings. It has given me the ability to be on the Dean's list and I just got my certificate uh, for outstanding achievement. I'm proud of it. And I was a little scared to be around people who are younger than me, with sharper brains, younger brains, and also raised in an environment with electronics at their feet and hands uh, from day one. Um, so I was scared. However, the first semester was the scariest, coming back to school after 30 some years. But uh, it has the scholarship or the backing, financial backing of donors has allowed me follow my dream and to achieve it while I'm still young and healthy. If the donor that gave you the scholarship was here right now, what would you say to them? I would do a little jig and then I would say thank you. You guys are awesome. You allowed me to prove my hypothesis that age is just a number. And with your backing, I can meet any challenge that comes my way. and my academic journey has been uh, just to work towards my nursing degree. Um, I'm second semester um, in the RN program and I plan on going for my bachelor's as soon as I gradu graduate and then uh, work towards my master's. Currently I'm really liking the OR, so that's the operating room in the um, like hospital. I like watching the surgeries and just um, the environment. I work as well as go to school. So this is really gonna help me with tuition, um, books, even gas, because I drive here from Visalia. 
So I just want to say um, thank you for taking the time. Um, this is really going to end up helping me in the end. So I just want to say thank you. <laughs> Again, my name is Chase White. Um, my, edu my educational goal for the moment is completing the psych tech program. Um, I am just about to be finished with the second semester and I'll be continuing third semester this coming, I think it's fall. <laughs> my current goals with my psychiatric technician license is to work at a psych hospital. Like right now, I just got hired on with a student position out at PDC, so I am trying to get my foot in the door but I know if I keep my eye out, I can eventually find a, br a bridge program and maybe possibly continue my education to more of a registered nursing field. It actually really helps me a lot right now. I, I mean, I'm working two jobs. I pay rent, pay insurance. I have bills to pay. I'm trying to buy a car. I've been using a friend's car. Um, I'm really short on money right now. I have animals to take care of. I have myself to take care of. It, it, helps more than I can really explain. I appreciate it a lot. Uh, I appreciate it, like I said, a lot more than I could even verbalize. Hi, my name is Yvonne Cifuentes, and my major is to become a registered nurse. Uh, I believe that a scholarship will have more than one effect in my life. It will push me to work harder and stay focused on my goal. My goal is to become a registered nurse because I always had passion to help others. I will accomplish these goals by gaining confidence and encouraging myself to achieve my goals. In order to succeed, I have been dedicating time, studying, and showing up to class every day. And my biggest goal is to be a role model for my three daughters. Scholarship is important because it can help me with my daughters, of course, and uh, just going towards textbooks or anything that I need to finish school. Thank you for selecting me. Uh, I, I appreciate it, and it's a, a blessing to be a, a part of this opportunity. My name is Antonio Rocha and I plan on continuing my biological and physical science major and I hope to get into the nursing program here at PC. Well, the ultimate goal is to get my RN license and maybe even after that further my education even more, get maybe my master's, something like that. I'm still thinking about it, but I'm really motivated on getting my RN license. It means that, I feel like it means to me that I put in hard work for my education after, since after high school. I've only been in college for about like two years, so I'm like pretty happy with where I am right now. I'm almost about to get my AA in biological and physical science. So I think it's pretty motivating. I just wanna say thank you for giving me this opportunity, helping me out with books, other class materials, and just the, it's basically like a pat on the back to me. My name is Alexandra Boyd and my educational goals is to eventually become a nurse. Um, I'd like to work with kids or maybe do um, be like an ultrasound tech. I'm not really sure which one yet. The scholarship helps a lot especially because I just well I just got in state but like I was out of state so um, it's a lot different uh, pay wise and I live down here by myself, so a scholarship helps in any way. Um, I would like to say thank you. Uh, I've gotten a few scholarships from PC and in the past, and they've always helped out a ton, no matter what amount.
my name is Matthew Cloyd and I hope to become a history teacher for either a middle school student or high school student. My major here is history and I've been here for, this is my second year. It means a lot. I haven't really got much of like financial help the first two years here, so it's gonna help like pay for the classes because it costs a lot more than a transferring than it does here. I wanna say thank you very much. It's gonna help a lot, a lot for me. My name is Kirtland Witt. My, I plan to major in bioresource and agriculture engineering. I plan to do that at Cal Poly like once I transfer. Next semester I'm planning to go to call it, transfer to College of the Sequoias just to get the classes that I need done for next semester or for transferring to Cal Poly. It means that I've put a lot of hard work in and then it's paying off. But I, it will help me to better further my education. I say thank you, you're helping me to graduate without any debt. It's greatly appreciated. My name is Ileana Jaramillo and I plan on transferring to Fresno State next year. I already accepted my admission to Fresno State and my career goal is to become a speech pathologist. I feel really honored to receive this scholarship. By receiving the scholarship, it will really help me focus more on school because I won't need to work as much so I will be focusing my time more on homework or labs or anything that has to do with school. It will also help me with my tuition cost uh, for Fresno State. I would just like to thank you so very much for giving me this opportunity to receive this scholarship. I really hope I get it and thank you so much, PC. My name is Sage Martinez. Uh, I hope to transfer to a four-year university, get my bachelor's degree in business administration. Um, after my bachelor's, I hope to go to graduate school and get my MBA. Receiving a scholarship will help me pursue my education because college isn't, it's not cheap and I, my family and I, we don't qualify for financial aid so receiving a scholarship will help ease my financial burden. Um, it's, it's a blessing. Thank you for choosing me uh, as a recipient of the scholarship. I thank you for allowing me to continue my education and have less stress of figuring out how I'm gonna pay for my tuition, housing, and all the other fees. Victoria Maddox and some of my educational goals are to complete my Associates for Transfer at Portable College and upon receiving that degree I am transferring to um, USC Bakersfield. I want to pursue my bachelor's degree and also credentialing to be an elementary school teacher. I really want to come back here to teach. Um, I was born and raised here 
Um, and I just want to give back to the community and the children that we have. For me personally, as a returning student and as a mother, um, college does come with some economical challenges and receiving a scholarship means a lot to me because it's going to help me with those financial challenges to achieve my goals of becoming an elementary school teacher. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for your donation is going to help me pursue my educational goals, but also it's going to help ease the pressures of being a mom and just showing my kids that no matter how difficult things are, that you just keep trying and you keep going and one day you will, you know, achieve them. And that's something I want for other kids to see too. My name is Ariel Starts, and I want to own my own or start my own business in the future. I want it to be here in Porterville, though, and I also want to get my bachelor's degree and hopefully my master's in the future. This will help me because it will benefit me financially and also like lessen the burden on my parents because it's pretty hard to contribute. But I'm very grateful for this having this opportunity, and I would want to thank them like really much. I'm graduating this spring with my associates in Studio Art for transfer. I plan on transferring to Humboldt State this fall and getting my degree in art education, getting my teaching credential as well so I can become a school teacher. Receiving a scholarship will mean a lot to me because I'm trying to complete my education debt free and any small amount of money will help me complete that goal and put a lot less stress on me to do that. So thank you very much for the donation, it means a lot. Hi, my name is Angelina Hernandez. Uh, I'm a freshman here at PC, and I'm currently hoping to attain my associates in studio arts for transfer. The type of art I'm most interested in is graphic design and illustration. Uh, I'm not sure which career path I would like to pursue, but those are the two main ones right now. Getting a scholarship, to me, it just means that I'll be able to be more financially independent and it also means that I won't have to worry as much about um, paying for classes or getting books. I can just focus on completing my coursework. To the donors, I would just like to say uh, thank you very much for choosing me. I feel very grateful and lucky to have this opportunity. Aiden Ramage. I will be majoring in kinesiology exercise science and I'm transferring to Azusa Pacific in the fall and I plan to get my major in kinesiology and become a physical education teacher and coach basketball as well. Receiving a scholarship means a lot to me with college being expensive these days any amount big or small uh, can help me continue my educational goals and further me in my career as well. I just want to say thank you to the donor giving me a scholarship because it means a lot to me and uh, just pretty blessed to get it. My name is Adriana Martinez and my goal is to graduate PC which I'll be graduating this semester and then I'll be transferring to California State um, University Bakersfield 
and my goal is to get my bachelor's degree and get accepted next year to the nursing program. Receiving a scholarship means a lot to me and it will help me paying with my books and anything that I'll need to pay in the future when I'm in the program itself. And I know that while being in the program it's hard, so it'll probably be hard for me to work, so receiving a scholarship will help me pay for anything that I need to pay. I would like to say thank you and that I'm really appreciative of the opportunity for them to ch have chosen me um, to receive the scholarship. It's my honor to present the Miranda Ella and Tom Rochelle Ocean Cornell Nursing Award on behalf of my family. The My name is Jessica Tabuco and my educational goal is to become a nursing. I wanted to finish my AA degree here at BC and also apply for nursing program and after that I wanted to go to um, um, Bakersfield to um, apply for my bachelor and finish there. It means a lot to me because since um, COVID right now it's really hard to like look for a job and I think it would really help me to to buy the things that I needed like books and other materials that it will help me to go further for my education. I would like to say thank you for choosing me and giving me opportunity for this scholarship. Um, this will really really help me to like um, to achieve my goals and dreams and to become a better uh, version of me in the future. My name is Victoria Fernandez. Some of my goals are to be receiving my biology major um, within the next few semesters and then I want to eventually transfer to become a respiratory therapist and the biology um, degree will help me reach that goal. Getting a scholarship means to me, it means a lot. First of all, being a college student, you lose a lot of motivation when you don't see your goals working in action and all the hard work you're doing. It's a lot of stress and at the end of the day, getting a scholarship means to me that I'm working towards my goal and I'm achieving things and it really motivates me to keep going. I would say to the donors, they don't know how much it means to the students. Just getting the title of a scholarship and how much motivation it can really push them to. Um, like I said, it's super stressful financially. It really affects your life and your motivation whenever you're in college and you have a lot of work and you also have work out of school. So a scholarship just means a lot. To, it really can be a boost on our confidence and just finances and everything in general. And a thank you, of course.
Uh, my name is Guadalupe Guerrero, and my educational goal is to be an elementary school teacher. For uh, My goal is to work at the PUSD district at Santa Fe because that's where I went for kindergarten to sixth grade, and that's my goal to work there. Well, it means a lot to me because honestly, my parents aren't helping me financially get through college and it's, they have to support, they can't because it's either me or my sister because we're both at the same time, same major and everything. So it'll help me because I'm transferring this year to CSUB and it'll mean to me because books are expensive over there and then I'm going to be going back and forth, gas also is expensive and then computer if I need a certain like program for a class that's expensive as well so it'll just help me financially because no one's helping me honestly. I just want to say thank you for the opportunity because I mean like I said as well I'm the one that has to put myself through college because no one else is. My parents I have their support I have family support and I have everyone's support but I just have to do it on my own. My name is Teresita Alfarez Castro and my educational goals, goals after here at PC is to transfer hopefully to CSU Bakersfield and it is to be a nursing major with a minor in social work. My ultimate goal is to become a NICU nurse. I've always liked to work with kids. Currently I'm a medical assistant for working in a pediatric office for eight years. So I've always liked and since high school I've always enjoyed working with kids. So that's like my ultimate goal, to eventually give a parent a hope in the NICU that, you know, it's okay if a child is in there and hopefully, you know, everything will come out all right at the end. Well, as a first generation college student, I'm very excited. This is a first time for me and for my family. So I'm very honored. I'm very excited. I'm very privileged at this point because I've worked really hard these past three years after a seven year break in, you know, from college and coming back and trying to come back as strong as I can to keep going and to show my five-year-old son that anything is possible even at a later time in life. What I want to say to the donors is like I'm very appreciative of everything you guys do for not just me but for everyone who has gotten this opportunity. I'm pretty sure everyone is very thankful and I'm just very honored that I have the privilege to be able to get this scholarship hopefully. My name is Jessica Cervantes. My educational goal is to get an AA here at Portable College and then transfer out to Fresno State and receive a bachelor's and possibly go on from there. At this point, I know that I want to go into business administration. So that's my goal. I know that I'll be graduating spring uh, 2022 if I, if I go on with that. To me, it means that it will help me with books, it will help me succeed forward with my career. I'll be able to save up and for my future goals in university, I know that it's expensive, so that means a lot to me. Um, it takes a little bit of stress off my shoulders when it comes to um, financial issues and stuff. I want to say that I appreciate you guys so much for everything that you do for the students here at PC, including myself. Um, without you guys, we wouldn't be able to move on and go forward. Um, you guys are a big help financially, and I appreciate and I want to say thank you so much for that. Hi, my name is Alexandra Garcia. I will obtain my associate's degree here at PC and then I will transfer to a four-year institution to obtain my bachelor's degree in political science. Then I hope to attend law school so that I can become a human rights lawyer. Well, to be getting a scholarship is a blessing. You know, it helps alleviate some of the stress brought on by, you know, the expenses of the course materials and stuff necessary to be successful and to get to where I want to be. Receiving a scholarship has given me more motivation to give back to the community just as you have through your generosity with providing me a scholarship.
my name is Jennifer James. I have been going to PC for about seven years now. I will be graduating May with honors and I am super excited to be going to National University afterwards to get my bachelor's in teaching. To have a scholarship is very important. School is expensive, everyday life is expensive. I am working part-time, going to school full-time, have three children, a grandson, and all of that costs a lot of money. So scholarships are very, very good for you. Thank you very much. Without the scholarships, people wouldn't be able to go to school. A lot of it is hard. And if you can't balance the work and the school and having other people help you out, you wouldn't be able to do it. I'm Justice Uphoff. Um, I plan to get a degree in mechanical engineering from Fresno State once I finish my uh, associate's degree in mathematics here. The scholarship actually means a lot. Um, I currently pay for all of my own schooling, so I pay for my textbooks, my classes, everything, um, and I take out loans to cover what I can't achieve through working. So the scholarship helps me uh, achieve those goals without having to take out so many loans and help my credit score long term. Uh, it does a lot, really. It saves me money. Uh, I would thank them uh, for their support in my goals and i um, very appreciative of all they do and the generosity that they have bestowed upon me um, and just really show my appreciation. Tyler Johnson. Uh, my major is in the administration of justice. My educational goals are to get, uh, firstly obtain my AA in criminal justice or administration of justice and then I'm going to go forth when I have time while I'm in the Ohio Patrol and go for my bachelor's degree and possibly my major. Uh, currently I'm going through the process of the, of the California Ohio Patrol and uh, doing school while uh, kind of balancing both acts. Receiving a scholarship to me uh, is means a lot. I've always heard of people that have received scholarships, but I've never received one myself, uh, just starting off in school pretty much. And it means a lot because now I have a wife and kids and that scholarship is not just going to help me, but it's going to help directly, you know, my family, my wife and kids, the people that mean the most to me. And it really gives me some more drive to really push harder in my both educational and career goals. Uh, thank you so much for just uh, caring basically uh, for your time and your financial support it means tremendously to me and my whole family and it really is motivational to know that people are really trying to help people in this world uh, who are trying to do good and I just appreciate your support. Hi, I'm Roberto Bajo Moreno, and I hope to become a video game programmer. And I, um, I plan to do this by, well, first off, this will be my last year at PC. And I uh, hope to accomplish my goals by transferring to CSU Bakersfield and earning my bachelor's in computer science. Having a scholarship will help me in my educational endeavors by helping me pay for uh, expensive classes or textbooks that I could not afford otherwise. Thank you, and thank you to PC for giving me this opportunity. My name is Jose Fernandez, and my educational goal is to to graduate Porterville College and transfer to Foyo University to uh, receive my bachelor's degree in business administration. I plan to be a successful entrepreneur and uh, run my own business uh, along with that. Um, I believe it helps me by lowering the cost of my college education and it allows me to stay focused um, on my, throughout my college education as well 
and it's just the opportunity to pursue my education. I just want to say thank you for the opportunity and the blessing um, for this amazing scholarship. My name is Maya Tapia and my educational goals is to um, go to CSUB and then um, get my teaching credentials and my bachelor's degree to become an elementary teacher and hopefully I could become a third grade teacher. It means a lot to me because I was chosen out of many people and um, it'll help me in the future like with my education for my classes or like for my books and that means a lot to me. Thank you a lot for um, giving me this opportunity to pursue my goals in the future. My name is Rafa Tahira. Uh, I'm a nursing student. I'm going to be graduating um, in spring 2021 and uh, my career goal is to do uh, bachelor's in nursing and then further master's in nursing. This scholarship is like a significant uh, help to create motivation and um, it's going to help me like uh, to just focus on my, my career goals. I'm going to say thank you so much whoever chose me uh, to invest in my future. Events like these would not be possible without the support of our donors and our community. Each year these donors support our students and encourage their success in achieving their goals. Without you, none of this would be possible. So thank you for your time, attention, and energy in supporting our students.